Hey guys, it's Marcy from Marcy Plant Ground and thank you for coming back. Right now it is 4.19 in the morning and if you're wondering what I'm doing recording at this time, I'm also wondering the same thing. <sighs> My head actually really hurts right now but the thing is that today I got new plants in the mail so I was like, I'm, I need to open them, okay? They came kind of rough. If I sound kind of deep voice, it's because it's 4 a.m. So, yeah. Oh my gosh, it's actually kind of open already. Let's see, plant haul. Guess from where? <laughs> yep, you guessed it. It's from Steep Sleep. I just really been into begonias lately. And they have a big selection of begonias. And. I live in Texas as well, so they usually get to me pretty fast, and I like that a lot. The longer that they are packaged up, the more they suffer, so you don't want that. So that's trash. And that's trash. Okay, I don't have anything like this one, okay? I'm just gonna open it over this box so I don't have it. Oh my gosh, you guys. Whoa! Some of these leaves seem to be this fuchsia color. Oh my gosh, I think it looks so stunning. She's so pretty. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm just like geeking out here. Oh my, oh, one of the little leaves fell. Maybe I can propagate it. Whatever you cut, you guys, and you really like, you can always propagate it. So, let's keep moving. This is why I'm up at 4 in the morning. And it's totally worth it. I know there's a lot of begonias that kind of look like a rope in a swirl shape. And I don't have any begonias like that. This is my first one, so cute. I'm very happy. And look at the bottom of the leaves. Like, that's what I saw first opening the box. And can you see why? Let's keep it moving. I have to be up in like four hours. So, yeah. This is the Begonia, my special angel. This is a cane begonia. I like them. those spotted dots that everybody loves the angel wing type this is my first angel wing begonia isn't she just wow i'm just spilling soil everywhere but i don't care i need you guys to see oh it's so beautiful gorgeous 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 is that a flower no oh, it's not no, it's not. Look, I, I just love looking at the new growth. Because if you see the new growth, that means it's a healthy plant. So you always want to look for that. If you stop seeing growth, there might be trouble or it may be in dormancy. Depends on the plant. I'm sorry, I didn't do my nails this time. I like doing my nails because who wants to look at this, right? <laughs> not me. Also, my nails just seem to not break as easy when I haven't painted. This one's definitely gonna need a drink right now. She's my child now. I need you to see her. Let me just blow some of the soil into this box. This is what I do when I kind of don't want to mess with the leaves too much. I just kind of blow on them. Just plant parent tips. Next. I'm so excited for this one. I'm so glad that it's at the end because blue plants. So this is her. And the thing is, it is kind of blue. It just kind of reminds me a lot of my begonia silver skies. Actually, 
Nah, you guys, this is cute. Like, this is different. <laughs> no, but I really like it. I like it a lot. Maybe with time, it'll, it'll look bluer, you know? There's a lot more growing right there and right here. And I just think it's the cutest thing. They're all out now. I don't like picking favorites, but... And I know there's so many um, varieties of, you know, angel wing begonias, but... This is my first angel wing begonia. I'm in love with these spots. They are stunning. Like, that leaf right there. Those spots. Mmm, girl. They look like angel wings. That is, like... I love her. I don't have favorites. I love them all. I'm just, I really like this. I don't know. I don't want to say anything. It's not true. It's not true. I love begonias. Anyway, my stepmom was nice enough to give me these glass candle holders. At their house, they had propagations in these and they look super nice. So she gave me some and I'm so thankful. And they're so cute. Scared. I'm just really sleepy. This was not supposed to take this long. These are hecking cute though. Ooh. I can have one glass, please. I feel so fancy. I could also put my Venus flytrap that I just got. <gasps> Wait, she needs to be in this video. She's also a new plant haul. <laughs> this is not a good example of what you should do. I have it in some water because that's what they had it in at the nursery. But my friend who has a lot of experience with these type of plants said that you should put it in some sphagnum moss. Wow, there's actually a bit of moss growing on top of the soil here. So that's nice. This would be a really great con container for these when I, once I transfer it. I just haven't had any time, but look at them. Some of them already ate something. It's just sickening. It would look so hot in here. Oh, there's another thing I got this week. I got this nice terrarium. Actually, the label said that it's a lantern, which I can understand. Uh, they had it in the terrarium section of World Market. I really want to put a rare begonia in here. My wish list is definitely the Chlorosticta red form or the U641. They kind of look similar. I know that they need to be in a terrarium. I really like the windowy look of it. It's very, very natch, very, you know, that farmhouse style. I like it. It's very cute. Oh my gosh, they're different heights. I just noticed. This is so, oh, this one broke. Why? Why does this happen to me? At least I have these two. Too bad. You guys. I wonder what height it was. Why do I torture myself? Man, they were all different too. I could have lived without knowing that. Okay. Nimodo, yeah. I need to repot a lot of plants. Been really busy with business stuff. And yeah, trying to get ahead in life. I don't have experience with these plants, obviously, so I'm not gonna explain everything. I do wanna show you guys. I was kind of gonna cut like whatever leaves I saw that I didn't think were healthy. There is this one on the Myrtle that is definitely not gonna come back from this. So I'm just gonna try to propagate this one for now. I'm gonna snippety snip her. Okay. 
So I'm gonna open up my new propagation stations that I got last week. Cause I think this little leaf is too small for one of these big cups, so. They really don't want me to steal these, huh? I'm just gonna take them all out. Oh, I love how they're all different sizes. They are different sizes. This is super cool. I just keep being surprised today. Well, I guess that makes sense with the length of these two. I'm so tired, you guys. Y'all just ever feel so tired that you forget what you're saying. That I could do your sandwich. Oh my goodness. You can even like arrange them like any way you want. Do y'all see this? This is too cool. Oh my gosh. This is so nice. So I'm gonna wash one of these because I washed so many dishes today. I am not gonna wash all of these right now. You. I'm gonna just cut off the Steve Sleeps Myrtle. And just remember to always sterilize your your pruners. This is 70%, 50% water, 50% alcohol. This is the gel. So I'm just gonna spray it oh, down here so I don't get it all over the place. And then we're just gonna snippity snip. Snippity snip. Okay, so she's pretty much already snipped, but it's so thick and juicy. Steve sleeps Mario. There he goes. There he goes. It kind of almost already looks more, more better. She looks like a candy, like seriously. It's gonna have to be pretty high because it's a pretty small leaf. I'm just gonna try to not get the leaf um, to be in the water somehow. Okay, I think that should be okay. And then I'm just gonna put this one in my north facing window. I live in a subtropical area, so I need to put this one in the north facing window, it'll scorch. That was my plant haul this week. Any weird plants I should get or any videos I should do, please leave a comment down below and don't forget to like and subscribe if you like the videos on that. On that uh. Like I said, I'm gonna keep collecting plants and I still need to film like so many that I have. Like I haven't even shown them. These are just the newer ones that I've been getting and I just, I've just been like, I wanna do plant hauls cause you know, cause I've been getting more plants. I'm gonna get in depth um, on some you know, specific plants in the future. So if you want to see any specific video, feel free to request it. And I'll probably have <laughs> one of your requests in my collection. I've just been going kind of crazy with collecting, so. Thank you for coming to Marcy Plant Girl and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye. <laughs>